Hey there guys, it's Salus, and welcome back to Blades of Time. When last we left off, we just basically slaughtered everyone in this general area. And apparently there's treasure this way. But we are heading towards the Dragon Temple. Everything is getting very real now. We are being attacked by Chaos and the Sky Guards, and I am having one hell of a day. So let's see what's through here. Aha, an altar. Give me your useless power. There we go, no power required because no power was needed. Okay, up the spire. They love spiral staircases. House prices in Brutal Tower must be really expensive. Right, let's take out the Sky Guard first. There we go. And anything in the way of the Sky Guard. Come on, just die. Just die. Die horribly. Or die nicely. Either one works for me, really. I'm really not fussed how you die, just as long as you do. Right, take down that shield. Why can the Sky Guards and the Chaos use the magic shields? Surely it would be linked to one or the other, right? Apparently not so much. Okay, cue that. Right, just take down that shield. Take down the shield. Take down the shield. Right, clones. Protect me. Okay, my clones work perfectly. And who said cloning was a bad idea? Alright, what's this? Oh, it's for that one. Okay, apparently did something to the blue door. You again? Really? This guy makes more comebacks than the Rolling Stones. No, chaos resides in you, sir, because you can't die. Apparently you don't know what's good for you. And believe me, death would be very good for you right about now. Especially a Q if you gave it to me. Right. Right, let's just... No, chaos resides in no one. Chaos is an... It's an existential concept. It does not reside in anyone. Chaos doesn't need a home. That would make chaos homeless. All this time, have I just been fighting homeless people? Right, slice off those venom canisters. Uh, uh, I resist because it's my right to resist. Have some crystals and a boom. And Q. There, I'll just freeze you instead. First time I ever used the ice power. Yeah, well, you know what's better for you? Burning. Burning horribly and then having your face repeatedly stabbed. And don't come back if you know what's good for you. Right, let's get out of here. Head into the blue door, apparently. You know what? It's been nice using the altars, but... I think I'm done with you now. Right, let's get out of here. Right, let's just quickly slide across here in case any Skyguard ships are out to kill me. Oh, it just opened the door. Didn't have a switch. That's what. Oh, that explains a lot. There's danger everywhere. Enemies are everywhere. Death is waiting. After their intrusion, Chaos started building a new army from the population of Dragonland, the main unit of which were the dragons. That we could also ask how Chaos captured the land of such powerful creatures as the dragons so easily. The answer lies in a deeper understanding of the Keeper's personality and the special abilities that make him an outstanding invader. Two for me around every corner. There can't be any other thoughts in places like this. 
Uh, I don't know. That guy in the book had a very, very strange thought of getting to know the Chaos Keeper. The guy is obviously a complete nutcake. Right. Oh, it's these things again. Okay. You know what? I can kind of live with that. Because these guys are incredibly easy to deal with. With the proper gun. Namely, my gun. Or just any combination of swords. Because swords work twice as well as they need to. Alright, they're all dealt with. That's lovely. Right, let's hit this switch. You think? The amount of weapons fire that's been going on in here, I'm not surprised the mechanism's damaged. Right, let's, let's speed this up. Right, I'm head of a chaos. Seriously, this asshole again? And he's cornered me on a staircase. Oh, there's chaos converted humans everywhere. Thank you. Not only are you throwing the chaos lasher into my face, but you're also throwing chaos converted humans. Thank you. Thank you, chaos. You're so nice. However, the sky guards just did me a favor. That's weird. Right, let's use these corals and get the hell over there. Where were they earlier? Have to ask. Right. Have some E. And I shall reduce you, sir, to paste, sir. Yep, there's the paste. Hello, rocket launcher. I've got to use this. Yep, you're blue paste. Come on, how many shots with a missile launch does it really take to lower your shield? While you glitch into a wall. Oh, you finally figured it out. How nice of you. That'll do it. Two at once, that's all it takes. Hmm, you think? It's the only way you can go, Ayumi, you dumb woman. Right, missile launcher with me. Oh, lots of these. So many of them. At least that means I'm quicker than the sky guards this time. It also means we've got the bigger gun. Well, let's just clear some space. Right, empty out of you and empty out my clip on you. And finally you. And you. Right, there's always one left. Where is he? Chaos will never give in. Uh, no, I don't think they will, but you can try. Right, let's just keep uh, blowing these guys up. Because it's fun! Why can't I reduce these to paste? The paste was the best thing about the Sky Guards. Okay, that shield cannot stand up to a missile. I'm sorry. No amount of shield will protect you from this. So, I'm going to let you get on with your day while I sneak around the back and missile you in the ass. There we go. See, that was easily dealt with. And with that in place, I'm going to leave it here for this episode. Until next week, I've been Salas. That missile launcher never gets old. And I will see you next time.